It's part three. You know what we're doing. So the reason why this video is taking a little bit longer, if you've made it this far, is because we pre-drilled these right here, this piece and this piece. Well whenever we did that, apparently because those boards were so old and twisted and everything else, that all the holes ended up being off. So what we decided to do on this one down here, as you can see we fastened it all in, um, is we measured the metal and that outer rim that we took off over there, we measured all that and put in, did all the math and we ended up pre-drilling the holes that way and everything ended up going into place the way it should have. So that's why this video is taking a little bit longer. But um, yeah, we should be able to get this video out today. But um, yeah guys, so that's just an update in case you're wondering why this video is taking a little bit longer than the other ones did. We are now re-measuring the plywood since we uh, messed up, so ye. So apparently there was some rats that got underneath this boat and chewed up this wire. And this one right here is chewed completely in half. I don't know if you can see this. But uh, right there as you can see it is completely chewed in half. And that's not good. So this one right here the, the wire is showing and, the, and if it gets wet that could cause a shortage. So I'm going to go ahead and tape this up and then down here. Actually, another one. You might can see it right there. Yeah, right there. If you look, right there is another one that I'm about to fix. And basically, what has happened with this one is they've chewed it. To what? Come on, focus. Did it? They have chewed it, and all the wires are actually split. So I'm gonna have to cut it and um, put them back together and all that. So. I'm going to show you that now and uh, we'll get back to the plywood in a minute.
So I used heat shrink cramps on this so that uh because it's going in the water, so everything needs to be heat shrinked and heat wrapped. That way no water gets into it or anything like that. So I'm gonna use this heat gun to uh, shrink it now. So this is going to end part three. Now, this wiring, it was, it, it went over really smoothly and I used the heat shrink because this, because it's a boat and it's gonna be in the water. And if any water gets into the lines, it can cause something to short or anything like that. And you don't want any of that. So all of that's fixed now. Uh, we have, we got three pieces of plywood on. There's still one more left to be put on, but I'm probably not gonna show that. You'll probably just ended up seeing, you'll probably just end up seeing it next time whenever we put the uh, sealer on this and whenever we put the carpet down. Um, now, there's another thing that's gonna be included in the next video and that's gonna be bolting this down right here. This is gonna be bolted down. And uh, yeah guys, so uh, if you like this video, be sure to leave a like, subscribe to my channel, and stay tuned for more. I'll see you next time, bye.